In this video I am going to show you, how to affect the elevation origin, a spot elevation refers to. In addition to this, I would like to provide some solutions, in case that Revit, doesn't let you place a spot elevation. This is a floor, which is placed 2 feet above level 2. I place a spot elevation and we see that the elevation value refers to the project base point. If you need to show the levels in relation to the survey point, then the spot elevation value should change too. You can change the elevation origin parameter of the spot elevation here. This is a type parameter, so better copy the type before making the change. Change the parameter value to survey point. As you can see the value of the spot elevation is now related to the survey point. There is another option for this parameter value. Just make another copy of this spot elevation type. Change the parameter value to relative. Now you can choose each level as base for the spot elevation value. Sometimes Revit doesn't let you place a spot elevation. First make sure that the visual style is not set to wireframe. If you still cannot place the spot elevation then check if another object is on top of the floor. Select the floor and isolate it and try now to place the spot elevation. If it is still not possible to place a spot elevation then maybe because the floor has a curved surface. This happens when a point or several points of a floor were changed. It is not possible to place a spot elevation on such a curved surface. You need to split the surface into triangles, because a triangle shaped surface is never curved. To do this you need to add a split line. Now you can place a spot elevation. You can also place a spot slope because these two surfaces are sloped. If you don't want to miss my next tips and tricks video then please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.